What's up guys, today we're going to be talking about future tablet technology for late 2016, 2017. So the tablet market has gotten stale a little bit. So I think these upcoming features would definitely uh, put some life back into it. So the first step is the Sony Xperia projector. So this is an innovative touch projector, which is really cool. So it's pretty much like having a tablet on virtually any surface. Uh, so you can pretty much beam this anywhere you want it to go and you'll be able to uh, use the Android operating system to uh, look at stuff on the web and do various things so how this stuff works is that it has a projective lamp and has built-in sensors to read hand gestures uh, with software management uh, the projecting can be connected to a mobile device or a computer via Wi-Fi uh, so it's pretty cool it has a built-in battery so you can pretty much take it anywhere so uh, let's say you're in the kitchen you can beam it on the table or anything like that so I thought this was a really awesome uh, little device and I definitely think it's the future of big tablets so next up is tablets with two operating systems so Telcast is one of the first manufacturers uh, to do this so they created a tablet that can run Android 5.1 in Windows 10 uh, so it's pretty cool you can switch from both OS's and I feel like um, manufacturers are going to jump on this also and you'll be able to switch from Android 5.1 to Windows 10 which would be really awesome so just the specifications with this tablet it's going to have a 2048 by 1536 display 4 gigabytes of RAM and 64 gigabytes of storage so it's based on the Intel Cherry processor uh, which is pretty speedy uh, and also it's going to have a 8000 milliamp battery so in the near future, I definitely see dual OS tablets being a mainstream thing. So last on the list is the Reflex Flexible OLED Display. So they showed this off in a prototype with a smartphone and I definitely think that this is going to be the future of tablets. Uh, so you'll be able to bend your display and you'll be able to use applications like reading books. You're able to bend your display like that. You'll be able to play games. So how this works is on the back side there are sensors determining the degree of bending. So this is definitely a future like I said we'll be seeing in future tablets. So thanks for watching guys. Uh, be sure to show some love and click the like button if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.